Okay, today we are making easy, complex ropes with a free plugin called Reaper. So first thing that you'll want to do is obviously go to the link in bio and download the plugin. And then once you do so, you just come down here and you should have two. I'm working on C4D R20. If you're working on a later version, they will have uh, updated versions. Click on whichever Reaper does not have the SE and then come over here and just grab a spline. Um, let's create a helix. Okay, and then take that helix, put it into Reaper and boom, immediately you have ropes. Now, anybody who has ever tried to create ropes knows how complex these can be to actually make and how much time it can take to make these. Um, so from here, you can affect your spline, obviously, and you know change all of these things. Um, and then, additionally, you can come into Reaper and change what kind of rope you want, whether that be a braid um, or other forms of ropes and braids. You can affect the coils, so you can make it a really woven rope almost like an Indiana Jones, he's dangling above a snake pit rope. You can affect the radius um, as well as the distance. And this can actually kind of create some pretty cool, some cool motion design effects, really. Now this isn't all either. So if you, you can delete your spline and once again, grab the Reaper and then grab the Reaper SE. And what you want to do within here is this is basically a form of making a spline that acts as even a more complex rope. So if we grab the coils and bring it down to maybe two and same with the strands and then drop it in here, you can see that now we can effectively have two ropes that coil around each other. Now, if we go into here and kind of change up some of these settings. Also, you can very much see how this could make good springs. Now you can make these kind of wrap around each other, which is pretty cool. Coils that will obviously make them more tangled. So there you go. So while ropes may not be the most common thing that you have to make, if you ever do have to make them or springs, uh, or even just some cool motion design effects, this free plugin can seriously speed up your workflow. Now, if you found this video useful, please make sure to like and subscribe and stay tuned because there's a lot more to come.